Welcome back to Let's Play Rise, Son of Rome. I'm Burning Dog Face. And we're here in what was once the shining jewel of the Roman Empire, but it's now clearly seen better days. Time to take on the Praetorians. Praetorians! What's this then? Valiant hero, battle scarred veteran of the castle. Why do they just attack me? Son of a bitch. <laughs> Fucking hell, I mashed the buton. This is gonna be rough. And there's only three of them, too. Victorious! <laughs> What's this, then? Valiant hero, battle-scarred veteran of the campaigns. Drop your swords, or I will kill you where you stand. Get him! Oh yeah, that would do it. Talk to you like that. Heavy! Mm, great. Look how much damage they do with just two hits. If I do, <laughs> fuck me. Once they start getting in, you really need to get out of the fucking way. I'm sure you will. Hey, I'm not the one who's gonna have a raping party over here. What was it we just read? It is cruel to the innocent not to punish the guilty. Hey, I'm just making sure there's no goodies. You don't have to throw the thing up there. Hmm. No, no goods or services over here. For just a second, because of the color scheme, I thought that was Winnie the Pooh. Well, surely, now that I've stood my ground, the, uh, Praetorians will give me no further trouble. 
And that won't come back Sir, to bite me in the ass. The legionary murdered Atticus and Janus! Someone's in there. You two, take a look. Nothing. Get back to your post. Yes, sir! I'm gonna have to stay off the streets if I want to avoid trouble. Serious question. How did I end up as a... Okay, one being promoted from Centurion to General, and two, being given command of a shitload of men, you know, for the uh, intro sequence. If I'm a uh, wanted criminal, more Nero, I'm pretty sure that means, uh, you know, die Nero. Pylum. Delicious. Pila, I think it is. Yeah, the people here really don't like this guy. Goodness me. I think it was Yornick who mentioned that, uh... Nero was supposed to be 30. What I want to know is, was he actually supposed to be fat? Because that's the thing that all of these, uh, let's say, political cartoonists are latching on to. Spread out! There's a rogue soldier on the kill, and we're going to find him. You! Murdering scum! Come on, lads! Drop your weapons! Maybe the ones wearing royal purple, but I think we've proven which uh, branch kicks more ass. the other side of him. I'm so used to dodge rolling with this crowd I forgot to deflect. Looks like I stabbed him right in the dick. Oh, I didn't actually use any. I seem to have interrupted that guy. Sorry, tree. Awesome. I never noticed that before. 
I'm so busy focusing on the actual battlefield and never the way the bolts just sort of fly into the uh, Scorpio by themselves. See? I'm sure, it's convenient though. Bet you need two or three guys to run one of those things normally. I guess this corner just exists for people to have a smoke. Except that I'm not sure they. Oh no, I guess that had pipes back then. I don't know. There he is. No more murdering for you, you dog. Stand down. Stand down or die. Stand down. Just who do you think you are? We are Praetorians. All right. Praetorians, barbarians, you all bleed the same. After what happened in New York, you have no idea. What the hell? Hey man, I'm not the one who forgot to even bring a shield. Why the hell is it there? That's what I'm looking for. Oh yeah, I guess I shot these guys, didn't I? That's a popular design. Pan, or whatever the Romans called him. I wonder why he doesn't have any arms. You'd think the arms would be intact in, uh, well, at the time. I remember reading once that it's likely all the ancient Greek and Roman statues are actually covered in paint, but that, uh, it had worn off over the centuries, so all that was left was white marble. People assumed that's what they were supposed to look like. punishment we're burying the whole street fuck <clears throat> oh yeah i'm going to enjoy stabbing that guy for once i actually hope they make that a qte because i would really enjoy murdering nero as opposed to a cutscene. So those first guys attacked me because I interrupted them from raping that woman. And because I ordered them to put their swords down. Hey, sup? How goes it? 
Well, you've clearly got better things to do, like clenching your fists. So, uh... Who will help us? There's no clean water. No sanitation. No bedding. And food! What food? I have to beg for it! Are you lost, stranger? No. I'm home. Not like you remember it, though, eh? Nothing is in Rome now. Hmm. Well, hold on to that thought. I'm gonna try and do something about that. Fuck, really? I knew Nero was a piece of shit, but come on. Like, he's right up there on the list of famously bad leaders. I mean, he's so bad that, uh... People use his name as an insult to describe other people's leadership uh, abilities. Leontius Titus, look at that. I thought it was weird that in that, uh... The last time it cut to the present, uh, Nero called him Marius Titus, and we'd never heard a surname before. See, Marius, it's not always in distant lands that our greatest enemies lurk. Who are you? Why did this happen? My father was a hero of Rome. Your father was a great general and a popular senator. Too popular, perhaps. The emperor is a jealous man. A petty man. lived to serve Rome. Emperor Nero serves only himself. He seeks power for the sake of power. He believes himself a god. A cold wind from the north whispered poisonous words in the emperor's ear. Your father and other like-minded men wanted to return Rome to its people. So the emperor had them murdered. After all, that is what emperors do. The spoils of his greed were divided between his sons, Basilius and Commodus. He lavished upon them great powers and responsibilities for which they were unworthy. Rome is failing its children, Marius. You are a vital piece in the game of man. And you, like all of us, have a role to play. Damocles, spirit of vengeance. The fate of the Empire is in your hands. Save Rome. Save Rome from them.
limited entry to the Emperor's tournament. This could be granted by just one man, so I paid him a visit. Damocles? I come for the tournament. Ah! <laughs> You're a gladiator. <laughs> oh. mm, the, uh, the mythical armor is it's a fine touch indeed. You gave me quite the shape. Only the most skilled fighters can enter the tournament. Let me see if you fight as well as you dress. Achievement unlocked. From the dead, become the righteous hand of vengeance. Hot damn. I'm Burning Dogface, and we'll see about that righteous vengeance in the next episode of Let's Play Rise, Son of Rome. Later.